Hey, what's up, guys? And today I'm going to show you guys how to. Get, this is not really a glitch tutorial related, but um, this is going to be how to get the Majora's Mask randomizer that released this Valentine's Day, um, of 2019. So I'm going to have all the files linked, and I'm also going to have the Discord link. That's where I got all the files, both the speed running and the randomizer Discord. So if you have any questions, you can go there. So you're going to go to the download here, and you're going to hit download. You're going to want to go to the uh, MM Randomizer, and if you don't already have WinRAR, I'll also link that. And you're going to have all these files. Now, I already extracted them to my download, my downloads, and I called it MM Randomizer 2019. And you're going to have all these. Now, you won't have any of these. These are just randomized uh, files. So you're going to open up an MM Randomizer.exe. And now, in the description, I'll have a uh, link to the ROM files, which I'll see if I have where mine are. Yeah, MM ROMs. So I'll have a link to this as well. And you're gonna Nintendo six then you're gonna wanna go to if you want to put on the Wii Virtual Console, there's a um I'd recommend um going into the Discord because they have a setup to how to hold your Wii. This is not about that right now. So what you're gonna do is hit open ROM and you're gonna go to the uh your Majora's Mask ROM. I don't know if it has to be NTSCU, but I use it. And now you have some settings, so you can have the rule set. So if you'd like to use a lot of glitches, you can do that. If you want to have vanilla, that means no items are really switched around. I don't know why you'd want to do that. The user logic, which if you want to customize your own logic, you can and no logic. So there's no logic, so anything could be anywhere no matter what you do. Use custom item list. I don't really bother with that. Um, the e stuff, I don't bother with either. Just leave them how they are. I should probably actually reopen that. Now. So here's the random elements. This is where you want to stay. So you want to make song. If you want to have songs randomized or not. Now in this randomizer you always start with the. Um, the sword, the shield, song of time in ocarina. That way you don't have to like. Look for Song of Time and Ocarina of Time, so you just lose all your stuff all the time. But you can mix songs. You can also mix up the dungeon items. So, like, for example, the bow can be anywhere instead of just in Woodfall. Uh, the shop items, so shops, items, you can be bought. You can't see them until you actually buy them, so you don't know what you're buying. Uh, the caught ball contents means, like, for example, if you swing your bottle at a fish, you could catch, really, like, a fairy. Or you could even catch, like, Deku Princess. Everything else is just a bunch of random stuff. Um, exclude Song of Soaring means Song of Soaring is not randomized, it's in the same spot, vanilla. Gossip Stone Hints, which means um, if you do that, then they'll tell you where stuff are, is. Dungeon Entrances, meaning if you enter, like, say, the Woodfall Temple, you might go to, like, Snowhead, Great Bay, or Stone Tower. Enemies, I would not recommend turning this on if only in beta, but it just randomizes the enemies that you see. It, it could soft lock, and then background music just takes music from different games and puts them in random spots. Gimmicks, um, you have damage, you have, um... You have you have double damage, quadruple damage, uh, one hit KO. I don't know what Doom is. I haven't played around much with that. Damage effects. You have fire, so you'll be on fire when you get hit. Ice, so you'll get frozen. Shock, so you'll get shocked. Knockback, so you'll get knocked back really far in the random. I usually actually play with random on movement. You're gonna have like high speed. There's a lot of soft locks. Super low gravity, so you go really high. Low gravity, so you go a little bit high, and then high gravity, so you go low. Floor types: sand, ice, snow, random. So it's pretty self-explanatory. And then you can change, like, you can shorten cutscenes and quick text. If you do not have this on, then you're just torturing yourself. And then tunic color. You can actually set custom colors, like, if I hit this, and then define custom colors. And then, like, for example, if I wanted, like, green, and then I could pick, like, whichever one of these greens I want, and then hit add to custom colors, and then hit OK. And then, yeah. And we'll just do, like, we'll just do the one I made. Play as, you can play as um, Adult Link from OT, which is basically Zora Link physics uh awkward time and majora's mask link and cafe i'll have the same physics just looks and tile color scheme you can have it um you have it dark you can have it warm you can have it cool you can have it random and you can also have rainbow i always leave on rainbow and that's really all there is that's like really all there is to mention that's usually all i do i don't really mess around with any of the stuff of stuff you can but i'd recommend going to the manual if you want to mess with that so then you go open your rom hit open and you hit randomize and you put your output, say if I just want to put it like, here's what I normally do, I go to like, um, sorry about my phone, I go here, and I name it R4, because I already have R1 through 3, and then hit save, and then let it load, 
And then one thing I should mention is if you do this on Project 64, which you might do it on Project 64. So you beat up Project 64, and then you go to File. I'll open my ROM. I'll open this one. Now, when you open it up, it, nothing will happen. Uh, it'll say this. You have to go to Options, Settings, click on the game, and then click on Memory Size, 8-bit. Hit Apply, hit OK, and then um, reset the game. So you go to System, Reset, Hard Reset. And after that, it should work. And that's really all there is to it um, for installing the Mojo's Mask Randomizer. I'll have the link to the the games that are in the randomizer and WinRAR in the description. Uh, I don't think I'm missing anything. So with that, I'll see you guys next time.